Well hello, welcome back. Today we're out on my Super Duke GT, just going for a bit of a ride through the back roads up to Fitford um, and then we're going to stop off at Lake and Heath and uh, see if there's any planes come in really and then have a ride back. Should be good, see you in a bit. Super Adventure S. Lovely bit of road this is. Hello, welcome back. Just out on my Super Duke GT. As I said, just going over to uh, Lake and Heath. Gonna just see if there's any planes coming out already. It's a nice ride up there through all the back roads. You know, Fetford and all that, it'd be lovely. So, hopefully there won't be too much traffic around because that's uh, nine o'clock in the morning. Yeah, it should be alright through these roads, they're not usually too bad, so it should be pretty clear. See the farmers a bit about, loads of hay all in the road. Yeah, some of you might notice I've got a little warning light on my dash. But that's just because it's just a server, so that's booked in next week to be done. I think that's going to be about 230 quid uh, for a 4,000 mile service. They're actually going to be changing um, the front discs and pads as well at the same time. They've got a little bit of a judder on the front. It's not too bad, but it's just a little bit, the last few feet when you brake, you know, you've got that little bit off on, off on. So uh, I popped in the saw them the other week and they checked them out and they said, yeah, it looked like you just warped a little bit. So I spoke to KTM and they've cleared it, they've sent some new ones and uh, they said they're going to be fitted next week. So. so there was no problem at all with the warranty claim, you know, they just sorted it, so it's all pretty good. Apart from that, the bike's been great. I haven't had no problems with it apart from that. But say, so if you're ever thinking about buying one of these Sig Duke GTs, I recommend it. Uh, definitely a good bike. As you probably saw in one of my videos, the Gen 2 actually is a bit of a better bike than the Gen 1, but the Gen 1's still a great bike. So I'd recommend either of them. There are some nice roads up here, once you get out of the 30s. So for those of you that are uh, interested in your two strokes, so like your two strokes and that, then uh, I'll be doing a rebuild on an RD350 LC on my site. I'm up to part six now, so I'm starting to put it back together. So that might be something that you'd be interested in watching. If you have a look at my channel, that's on there. And if you're into your KTMs, the, obviously I've got a Super Duke GT, but um, 
I've done a couple of reviews in the last few weeks. One on a Super Adventure S and one on a 890 Adventure. Both the new bikes out for 2021. So if not, you might be interested in them. And if you're into your track days, I've got some track day videos on there as well. I've uh, got Cadwell Park and Donaton and stuff, so, so take a look. It's nice out this way. Literally come up to Beckford Forest and all that, lovely. Hopefully we might get lucky today and uh, see some planes coming in the land or taking off. Let's see, you never know up here though, because obviously there's no timetables enough and you just go up and you might get lucky, you might not. Looks like we got lucky.
sound awesome. Look at that, look. Oh yeah. <laughs> what a job. Wouldn't want to go in there. Looks like I might be coming back round again, I reckon. Definitely got lucky today. There's a few about here now. I don't get a lot better than this. Is actually going to land that one? No? Yes? Yeah. So gradually coming in now. Yeah, this might be a lot now. We're all starting to land. I think I struggle getting out of bed in the morning to go to work. Sure, that's it. I think that's all of them now. Well, it's been a good morning really, had a nice ride out, hasn't rained, which is unusual. 
uh, saw some planes, it's been a nice ride, so yeah, it's been good. But so don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you all on the next one.